Good evening, I'm Megan Mannering. And I'm Larry Smith. Glad you're with us. A district judge, judge is dead in Letcher County after a shooting at the courthouse in Whitesburg yesterday afternoon. Troopers have charged Letcher County Sheriff Sean Mickey Steins with murdering Judge Kevin Mullins. Whitesburg is a very small, close-knit community in the eastern Kentucky mountains. To say the community is in shock would be an understatement. LEX 18's Drew Ammons spent the day getting reaction from people in Letcher County. He begins our team coverage at 6. This is downtown Whitesburg, the day after multiple agencies arrived on scene responding to the shooting at Letcher County Courthouse. Uh, 36 students being at Letcher County Courthouse. That shot's fired on the second floor. Fired on the second floor. You never think it's going to happen to your community until it does. We knew something was really, really wrong. When the shots rang out here at Letcher County Courthouse, Joseph Banks, one of the residents we caught up with, rushed to the scene and when he got here it wasn't anything that he had expected. A friend of my wife's called and said you guys need to lock the door there's been a there's an active shooter in the courthouse. Well instantly we were shocked. Zariah Banks was in town at the time of the shooting. Really was scared. I thought well we need to lock the doors and just wait to see what's going on and I was just thinking oh wait, okay I'm gonna just go under the desk and just <laughs> hold my, myself. Judge Kevin Mullins was shot inside chambers pronounced dead at the scene. Sheriff Mickey Steins is charged with the murder. He was very good sheriff with us, so then that's, it is very shocking that he reacted that way. Sheriff Steins, 43 years old, was first elected sheriff in 2018 and re-elected in 2022. Judge Mullins served as a district judge since 2009. He was 54. Lacey Wright, who lives in Whitesburg, reflects on the chaos. It was just upsetting for everyone involved. Letcher County Courthouse is temporarily closed and court operations in the county are on hold, according to Jamie Neal, communications specialist for the administrative office of the courts. In Letcher County, Drew Ammon, LEX 18 News.